You've talked about uh, uh, regulatory functions of the ERC and your friends in the DOE, but what about uh, modern technology? Because, parang when when I was reading all of the reports uh, online, etc., it turns out that our power plants <coughs> are the same power plants from what 10 years ago, 20 years ago, even 30 years ago, and and sabi ko, anong klaseng sistema ito that na, Ayala, yes. Okay, Ayala, San Miguel, they had some solar uh, sa so nakita ko. Pero parang uh, we haven't made the major, you know, the 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 serious shift to renewables. Uh, what's on the table as far as this is concerned? Because that seems to be the only relief. Well, that's correct, no? Uh Sa totoo lang, if you have uh, more renewables today, we won't be finding ourselves in this particular situation that we are basically hostage to uh, fuel, uh, fossil fuel-driven supply. No, mm -hmm. uh, I think uh, in the next couple of years, and uh, to be fair, no, uh, we had seen a massive expansion in renewables led by uh, different actors, no, uh, power actors, and. Uh, I think it is a uh, it is the situation that we would want to find ourselves in uh, expanding further on uh, in the future, no? Because, siempre, ultimately, it has always been a question on where um, the delay has been, no? Is it a delay because of uh, power players, or is it a delay because government has failed to act in a swift manner to basically allow all of the permits? To be undertaken. I think it has always been because government has been in a delay. What are we in for for the this uh, last two months and uh, also for the first quarter? Are we going to have a prince of darkness? <laughs> well, I certainly hope not. No, but I think the challenge now on ERC is this: given uh, their decision, talagang lock in na ho sila doon sa price proposal nang rinreject ko nilang petition. Pag nakita po ng publiko na mas mataas po yung price proposal sa emergency procurement at sa WESEM, ang sisingilin po ron yung ERC po mismo. Ang pinakamasakla po dyan, baka singilin po mismo yung Pangulo na wala po siyang gagawin dito po sa bagay po na ito. Well, nakita po natin yan doon sa labanan po noong 2013, no? Mm. Uh, nagkaroon po ng labanan on different issues, no? Pero... Nito lang ho talaga siya na resolve. So, uh, this will play out, I guess, not just in the next few weeks, baka in the next coming years. Pero, what we are most interested in, ano ho yung mga kabinipisyo sa publiko in their day-to-day -day lives, no? Wala ko tayo pakialam doon sa korte para hmm. dribbling, out, dribbling it out for the next five years. Ang tanong ho natin, magkano yung presyo ng kuryente pagdating ng Pasko? pagdating po ng susunod na taon. Okay. Kung hindi, hindi ka kayang i-assure ng gobyerno po yun, ayusin ho nila yung buhay nila. <laughs>